Now, you, how do you hang in there during the hard, difficult times, Les? You must have faith. You've got to believe in yourself. You've got to believe in your abilities. You've got to believe in your service, your company. Your so I just wanted to, to jump on real quick and share with you guys something because some things been going on. You know, I got to keep it 100 with you guys. And with this new way of, of training my mind and this new way of thinking and, and just being optimistic and, and staying positive with all the tools that I learned throughout the past two years, you know, I refuse to sink into a place of depression. You've got to be unstoppable. You have to operate like Willie Jolly, who said a setback is a setup for a comeback. You've got to be relentless. When you're building a business, you got to be able to have courage. But for a while, I've been struggling to, um, you know, pay my rent or whatever. My unemployment is very small, and it, it's just been very difficult. Um, last month, some information was given to me, but it, it, it was it was wrong, you know, to say the least. The way she explained it to me, the secretary in the leasing office, wasn't quite the way that it, you know, that it is. And I say all that to say this, you know, I was supposed to move out. They was going to um, write me a check so that I can find another place to move into, you know, so I wouldn't be, you know, all out homeless or whatnot. But it didn't work out that way when I got everything moved out of my um, house and I turned the key in on the 31st the uh, property manager was like hey what can I mail the check it'll be three to four weeks and I'm like whoa you know I ain't got three to four weeks I'm at zero right now I have no money I, I spent money hiring a moving um, company because you know I can't do a lot of moving things myself because I have Carpetana in both hands and it's just me so of course I needed help so I hired um, a, a truck, a moving company I'm zero out, I'm looking forward to the check that you that y'all are going to cut me so I can cash it and, and, and find me a new place long story short that didn't happen that way I ended up having to stay in my apartment and now I'm um, thousands and thousands of dollars behind and possibly facing a, an eviction now I say all that to say this the old me will be somewhere you know just now I'm worried slightly but just slightly you know because I just know that with this new way of thinking stand positive letting God do his work Everything is going to work out fine. But I'm just sitting here thinking about the old me and how the old me will be literally depressed right now. I'm putting my mask on so I can go to Walmart. And I just thank God that I'm not. I'm going to get through this just like I've gotten through everything else. Life is hard, so do it hard. And that's what, that's what I said. Life is hard, so do it hard. And I'm going to make it work. I just want to holler at y'all because it was just on my heart just to share that with you guys. But I will talk to y'all later. You already know how we do. Warrior moves. Love each other, support each other, but most of all, know your worth. I'll talk to y'all later. People know that you know what life is, that you have embraced life. You knew it was hard, but you did it hard.